Hey guys, it's been a while. Today is 18th of December and I haven't been vlogging both on Saturday and Sunday. So finally I am back. It's Monday. So I've decided to film a chatty get ready with me. I mean now it's uh, pretty much evening already but I'm not planning to do this makeup for anything special. I'm simply going to the supermarket and I've decided to share with you guys what kind of makeup I would do if I want to have like the most minimalistic no makeup makeup type of look if you know what I mean. So let's get started and at the same time I will explain what's been up this weekend so beforehand the only preparations that I've had for my face I just put a moisturizer the one from Clinique moisture search perfect for winter time so I've just prepped my face it's nice and clean and moisturized which is the most important thing because my skin tends to get super dry so now the first thing I put on is the CC cream plus your skin but better from it cosmetics which is the perfect solution if you want a really light coverage i mean it's not sheer like so that you cannot see it you can see it just enough i think it's really perfect for everyday use and i like to use my fingers because with the beauty blender it just sucks in all the product and it's such a waste so yeah i don't mind using my fingers if you do then use a brush but i'm cool with that so basically the last time I was vlogging, it was Friday, the epic party. And um, obviously I came back home very late. I mean, it was pretty much morning, but actually the last two hours, it was just the way home. It took me so long to get back to the turn. I had to change trains. I had to wait for such a long time. And then to get to the station from the club, it was also a struggle but oh my god it was amazing solomon was just awesome he, he was playing his set for five hours five hours guys it was amazing the music was so like deep and um i haven't heard any of these tracks before so he did really an amazing job but unfortunately i missed quite a lot of the show because i was just hanging out with some people in other locations you know this chill out area so i missed quite a lot but still i got the whole experience i was dancing away the whole night i loved it so much and i cannot wait to see solomon again because he comes to switzerland pretty often actually so that's that and the next day obviously i was just recovering okay i was sleeping i had two naps and yeah that's all then in the evening i went to take Ole to the airport because she left for holidays to Russia so that means that I have the whole room for myself for the whole week which is pretty exciting it feels actually very unusual and I'm not used to being alone at all because for the last two months we've been together all the time either I'm in classes or when I'm back home or is here as well so it's been a long time since I've been alone sometimes you just need those moments to be with just yourself i really really need this so um yeah and so then saturday was just recovering going to the airport the next day actually was also a very sleepy day because you know when you go to a techno party it means that your sleeping schedule is completely uh, upside down you know i was not sleeping the whole night and then sleeping the whole day so from saturday to sunday it was the same situation i was doing my last paper until the very morning i submitted the paper and today i woke up like at three because my sleeping schedule is completely messed up it's horrible but let's roll with that now i'm like awake and energized i just realized that i've been rubbing my face with this cc cream for the last like 10 minutes okay so i think we're done with blending in the cc cream and let's just do a little bit of concealer just a tiny bit i have this la girl pro concealer in the lightest shade and i just want to put a little bit under my eyes just to freshen up myself a little bit and i understand that nobody in the supermarket would care about my fresh eyes but in case i want to film some videos later on i want to have some fresh awake eyes so now i need to take care of my pimples which are mostly in my chin area and i have this concealer from mac i don't know what's the name actually but it's like quite a heavy concealer 
which will do an amazing job covering my pimples. I mean, it's not like active pimples, it's the ones that are already finished, but they stay red for such a long time. I have like really problems with redness for the most part. I would not wear makeup, honestly, if it wasn't for my redness. And I saw some people commenting that I have like an amazing skin. Guys, don't be fooled. This camera, I don't know what it is, but it makes your skin flawless. No matter if you have like the worst skin day, it just blurs everything. I don't know why. Don't think that I have a flawless skin. I'm so far from that. I mean, it's better. Actually, I was struggling with acne for the last six months. I really have to make a video about that because it was horrible. I have pictures, I have everything. I need to share this story. I mean, I always had problems, but at some point it was like the worst ever in my life. And now I'm still kind of recovering. So yeah, I don't know why the concealer is not helping. <laughs> like all this stuff. I mean, it's already covered with makeup for the most part, but still it's it's not perfect, it's very far from perfect, but thank you for the compliment anyways. And now I want to set my face, because if I don't do this, my makeup will just slide off. So I'm using this mineral powder from Gosh. I mean, my favorite powder is actually from NYX, the HD transparent powder. It's the best for really mattifying your face and keeping it in place for the whole day. And this stuff I don't like, it really doesn't hold my makeup for like more than two hours. I don't like it, but I need to get the refill for this. But for now, that's all we have. So what else I can tell you guys? I mean, now it's my turn break. It's official. Now that I finished my paper, I can just take my time, relax and do whatever I want. And actually everyone is already gone from Lucerne. Everyone went to their home countries and to vacations. And I feel like I'm the only person left here, okay? But I'm also leaving on Saturday night, I think. Then I come back and then I have like four days left of my term break. It's a really, really long term break, right? So yeah, I have a lot of time for YouTube and things I love and I just, so happy right now I feel like when I start to do makeup and I say okay I will do like a natural look I get into the mood and I end up with like a full face glam but we don't need that today so let's just stop when it's time to stop so brows of course I use the brow zings from benefit the one with the, like the waxy part and the powder part I love it, it's so easy to use. Before I used to use those like uh, brow wiz stuff, but the, to be honest, they take too long. In my opinion, I just prefer this method. It's much faster and looks the same actually. <laughs> By the way, I had my lash extensions done when I was in my hometown a month ago and I still have a few lashes left. I really enjoyed lash extensions. It was so easy to get ready in the morning, so fast and looked so much prettier and yeah, I just loved it. So what else I can use? Oh my god, highlighter, 100%. Wow, wow, beautiful. I'm obsessed with this one. So this makeup is something that I actually wear to classes most of the time. Sometimes I change up lipsticks, but basically this is my everyday makeup and uh, if you are interested in some of the products that i've used i will list them all down below in the description before i used to wear more makeup but now i try not to because i don't have time and i think it looks good enough you know so yeah let's get going for some food usually i do this in the bathroom and i have it all there in the makeup bag but for this video i had to film somewhere with a nicer background so i have to clean up this now oh my god it looks so horrible guys can you see this highlight it's so gorgeous i'm obsessed with it but anyways i wanted to tell you that the supermarket that i'm going to is at the train station because the ones that are close to my place are closed already welcome to switzerland they close at 6.30, so ridiculous, but the one at the train station works until 10, so I have quite a long way, but I mean, not a long way, but it's not five minutes way, instead it's like 15 minutes.
I am back home guys in my usual spot in the kitchen where I tend to speak with you most of the time so I just wanted to share with you what I got in the supermarket and this time I went to Migro and I feel like Migro is slightly cheaper than Coop Coop is like the most expensive one here and Migro is like in the middle of everything so I tend to go there more often and also I go there because they have our, our favorite IC so I obviously got this one and it's a smaller version because Ori is not here so I feel like I would not drink the whole 2 liter box in this one week so I got this next I got some sunflower oil because I use it a lot actually I use it in cooking and sometimes in salads then I have chickpeas because who doesn't like chickpeas you can use them anywhere in salads as a side dish then I got some smoked salmon my obsession I just love to put it on like a bread with cream cheese and in salads again it was on sale so I decided to treat myself then I got some spaghetti some toast bread the usual staple cheese like the one that is already sliced just easier then I got some corn tortillas because it's just so quick and easy to throw everything you have in the fridge wrap it you can also grill it on the pan on the frying pan and you're good to go and then I got a lot of iceberg lettuce for tortillas and for salads as well and then I got some salted cashews oh my god it's like a guilty pleasure they're so good you can just eat them as a snack like a healthier snack or put them in salads as well mm, so good and um, yeah that's pretty much it I didn't get too much because I'm leaving on Saturday so there's no point in getting too much yeah but I think that will be enough so now I gotta clean the kitchen because look at this you cannot really see but it's very messy it's a lot of dirty dishes I have all the time in the world now so if you ever wondered what I get up to when I'm home alone this is exactly that I just dance away why not I have so much energy because I slept two, three, and now look at me dancing alone in my room. All right, I need to clean this. First, I will put away my groceries. Remember when I told you how I'm obsessed with salad? So currently, I have three types of lettuce in my fridge I mean it's just leftovers so I got a new one but just another proof that I actually love salads alright hey guys so I'm currently on the train to go to Zurich it's a crazy change of plan because I realized that only my good friend has a birthday today. I used to work with him and I decided to just kind of surprise him and come see him and wish him happy birthday. And a lot of my ex co workers are going out all together, so I decided to just just do it. I really just I decided to go like 30 minutes ago and I just bought the ticket, went to the train station, and I'm on the train now. I'm going to Zurich. Kind of crazy, I know. But I mean, my holidays have just started, so I decided to just say to myself, why not? And do something crazy like that. I'm on the way. I will arrive at midnight. Pretty late, but it's alright. <laughs> okay, so. But it's my birthday. Come yeah, on, it's man. your birthday. Happy birthday, Draghi. So I arrived in Zurich. Yeah, and I have. It's, this little Prosecco bottle, that's all I have. Li little one, it's a nice gift. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. So we're going to this shisha bar now where everyone is. And I still cannot believe I'm in Zurich. Oh my god, guys, can you see? This is Marriott Hotel. Hopefully. My favorite place in the world, okay. Like this? Yeah, yeah. Yes! Amazing. Thank <laughs> you, cheers. 
Can you please two chairs for the camera? No. Entschuldigung. <laughs> <laughs> for YouTube, YouTube. <laughs> YouTube. Very happy, so long.